Hey, what's up, people? Welcome back. Uh, so, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add post in WordPress. So, as you can see, we are right now inside the WordPress dashboard. And if you're familiar with the WordPress dashboard, this is the WordPress control panel that you'll be using. So, if you hover over to the sidebar on the post, you will see an option here called Add New Post. You can click on that, or otherwise, you can just hover over to this the option on the top it says new and uh, select post and either way it will take you to the new post and now because the WordPress is updated uh, it's not the it's not same as the classical editor I would suggest you guys to add a classical editor, editor because that will give you a very uh, in a clean look uh, you can do all the customization using this one as well uh, with a new version of WordPress post uh, but I would suggest you to have a classic editor so we'll go to plugins, click on add new plugins and from here you can see there's the most used plugin more than 10 million active installations. Just click on install now and this will start installing the plugin for you. And once this is installed don't forget to activate and uh, after the activation you don't have to do anything just go back to post, select add new post and now we have a uh, or old school method of adding the post with all the features you'll have the same features it's just that the interface will change now let's give it a title because we are you know creating a sample post here oops i'll change this to english we'll name this as another post or just just title and uh, once you're done this is the most important part because this is going to show up in the search engine and uh, this will be the link to your uh, WordPress post that uh, you're gonna create and make sure that your link is same as the keyword that you're trying to rank it for uh, don't just uh, enter a different uh, permalink here like the title is another post title but don't enter something else here just make sure that it resonates with the title and it's short crisp, crisp and uh, uh, you know, clearly tells what this post is and that's that's about permalinks and once you finalize the permalink don't forget to enter the the post content a post without the content or just title cannot be published because it's it's it, there's no point so make sure to add the content here something that you want to write and uh, you have all these formatting options here you can select this and make it bold or italic or you can add a bulletin you can add the numbers if you want this in order you can add a number list and you can add block codes and you can change the alignment here and let's say while uh, you know writing a post or writing the content for this post you have something for YouTube and you want to have uh, you want to set up a link just select this YouTube click on this link here and enter the address here https this is just for the demonstration guys you can enter youtube.com and uh, or the link that you want to set up and you can see how we have the post and a link here which is embedded in, uh, you know, on this word youtube and likewise you can insert more tags and uh, other you know toolbars if you click on this uh, option here you will get more options to customize and uh, if you want to add an image or uh, something you can do that from here like you can click on add media and you can select an image that you want to enter within the post so you can select and drag and drop this wherever you want so it's up to you guys you can you know do this with all your creativity and once you're done with this one you can go go to this option here this window which says publish make sure uh, that you know if you are just uh, doing this for your own reference and you're not ready to post this you can save this as draft either you can save this as draft or you can save this as pending review if it is a team that you're working you have a team of full of content editors or the managers for this website you can select this as pending review so that will be the status that you can update and then you can change the visibility here you can turn this into private and then uh, regarding the publish you can if you click on publish it will up, uh, publish immediately but if you click on edit and uh, from here you can schedule this post let's say you have all this post set up on the weekends and you can schedule this as per 
your requirement and whenever you want to schedule and if you don't want this post and you just want to delete this you can click on move to trash and that's how you can uh, you know edit a post and make sure that you know if you are a blogger if you're starting a blog and you have a lot of different categories of posts that you're gonna publish uh, make sure to add a category here you can click here and add a category and from next time whenever you when you're posting something related to that category make sure to select from this category because now this is just for demonstration I don't have any categories and this website is uh, something that I don't want to publish so I'm not gonna be doing that and uh, I'll make another video because this is a very wide topic categories and tags I'll make a different video explaining you how it works and how we can leverage this to uh, you know enhance your blogging journey or you know just for you know refer for your own knowledge if you are a WordPress user or using the WordPress for your business or personal and if you scroll down you have something called featured image here this is the most important part guys you can see that this is the image uh, that you can set click on set featured image I'll select this for now this is one of my YouTube video thumbnail that I'm just uh, doing for uh, selecting for the demonstration so now what will happen is once you set this featured image and you publish it will show on top on top of this post now let's go back to us and click on view post to see the featured image here uh, because my the alignment and the website code is not okay I'm not able to see this once you have a good th theme and uh, you have all the settings uh, in place you should see the featured image here and it's not only that it will also show on social media when you try to share this post link on Facebook or Twitter or any other social media you'll be able to uh, see that the featured image will be same as the one you have set so that's how you can create a post uh, on WordPress with all these options in my next video I'm gonna be showing you how to uh, use tags and categories so you can have uh, more options with your WordPress and enhance your WordPress journey. So thank you so much for watching guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.